Hello, my friends. And in light of recent events, I'm going to do a special video in which, well, we've all learned what happened over last over last weekend. Satoru Iwata, Nintendo's president, has finally passed away at the age of 55. He has... He has basically went through hell and back with a bile duct, um... bile duct growth and died of cancer. And I know that there are many, many, and I do mean many of us gamers who are still mourning the loss of his passing. Most in which many people feel they can't say anything because they don't have words for it. Which is totally understandable. say to that is, well, cancer's a bitch. But I feel, although we should mourn his passing and everything, and everything of that nature, I feel we need to, we need to, as gamers, we need to grow the fuck up. And I do mean we do need to grow the fuck up. I mean, we all think, you know, there, there is fanboyism, which, in which, you know, most play favorites with um, certain companies and whatnot. We have certain expectations that need to be met as gamers, even though I feel there should not be expectations when it comes to gaming. I honestly feel that what the man did was the cornerstone of what made us gamers to begin with. Quoting the words, quoting his last words, he might have had the mind of a of a programmer, but he had the heart of a gamer. I know many people have been playing a um, few games that have been classics. To me, Stunt Race FX is a classic game. This is one of those games I just randomly, I randomly just, you know, <laughs> got because I randomly got because A It wasn't just mode seven, but it was just It was just straight up fun.
You know what I mean? That's what it's all about. It's about having fun. It's not about getting achievements. It's not about getting high scores, even though that's part of it. Games are about having fun. I actually do mind, you know, having fun in my games. That's why I'm a gamer. Get your ass back! Bye, y'all. And what I mean by we need to grow, we need to grow up. It's hard for me to explain this, but sometimes you really do need to stop thinking about, oh, it's all about this and 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 this. I say you buy a game just to play. You don't buy it for anything else. Whenever I buy a game, it's just for the very reason that I want to play it. I don't have certain expectations. I'm a gamer, not a critic. I was never good at this. I really wasn't. I was never good at this part because... This <laughs> was just hard. <laughs> I did for a second, so shit. I don't care. I mean, we need to enjoy games, you know? We need to enjoy more often and bitch a lot less about, you know, video games. Actually, I like this this point of view much better because I can see a lot more of I can see a lot more I really can see a lot more of the field this way. So 
So, I feel, in the interest of fairness, that we need to act more like gamers. And, you know, enjoy games more often than, than try to, oh, I don't know, one-up each other in, in video games. Back down. I know you back there. If you can't tell, this is my favorite. Um, if you can't tell, this is my favorite <laughs> car to use in Stunt Race FX. let this loss, you know, stop them from what they're doing. So, all we have to do is... <laughs> continue to do the same thing we've always been doing. Play video games. Let Nintendo worry about what they're going to do in, in the future. Right? And, and 2006, oh, it's gonna be a dark. It's gonna be a dark day. No, it isn't. It's gonna be a dark day when video games become outlawed. That's gonna be a dark day. When video games, anime, and all that kind of stuff that we hold as our livelihood, when all that shit gets outlawed, that's gonna be a dark day. When it gets banned and whatnot, because it's already happening in. It's already happening in some other place, but still. Let Nintendo worry about that. The only thing we can do is offer support, that's all. We need to get over personal feelings about... about, you know, what they did in the past, be it good or bad. Because you tend to forget, Nintendo is still a company. Uh-uh, stay back. So I say let her continue to keep on gaming. As I wouldn't I wouldn't really, I really wouldn't want Iwata san to be sad in heaven as he did what he did, survived so long as he did as president of Nintendo. And personally, it was if it if it was for our livelihood. If it was for our livelihood, then it was for the greater good. He fought as long as he did for whatever he had inside him, and now he's not suffering anymore, which we should look as a saving grace. And y'all better back the fuck up, thank you. I know y'all 
back, baby. Shut the fuck up. I hear y'all back there. Shut up. in the best way I possibly can. Have fun. Have fun while I'm making this tribute video of the man who gave us our lovely hood and you put a fuck up. Nothing more to say except that, well, let's continue to be gamers. Let's not worry about what's going to happen now. Let's focus on the present. I mean, that's all I have to say about that. It's, it's just as simple as that. Let's worry. Let's worry about some something other than you know. You know, company affairs. Everything will be all right. I mean, let us have a moment to mourn for the passing of beloved President Sa Satoru Iwata. And on behalf of myself and perhaps the rest of the crew of RCO Industries Incorporated. Arigato gozaimasu. Iwata san. Thank you for bringing gaming to our livelihood. You will be missed, but you will also be remembered in the games that we play. So with that, I've been the 10 KH of gaming, Pookie Izzy7, and this was In Memoriam of President Iwata. The game I played was Stunt Race FX, so I hope you have enjoyed. I have set my piece. So with that, cry if you need to, but also smile when you can. Take care, God bless, and of, and of course, as always, Tenkai Musou.